So I'm going to be setting these up as legs as a support. I have the height and the width. Now the first thing I want to do is, and again you'll see on the desk itself, I don't want this rubbing on the desk and causing some damage. So I'm been looking for the things I have around the house so I don't have to go down shopping anywhere and what I'm going to do is literally just put a couple layers of this on here nothing fancy All right, since you've been so patient so far, and I appreciate it, doesn't look like much, uh, but now you're going to see why I have set this up and made this for a an old-fashioned desk. So don't go away. I'm going to go into another room and put it to the test. Alright, at the moment, this is my uh, desk, this is the lower area, I'll show you above what it's set up, a little crowded right now. Uh, what I have on either side, not the best setup, I don't know how I came up with this initially, because it's certainly not functional, is uh, this with a buffer on top to keep the desk from being scratched. I'm going to slip this in. Have to go in behind that wire right there. All right, so here, here is what I've done. Specifically, at the bottom two sides, uh, there's a very narrow footprint now. What I had before were these. Now, this desk here belonged to Mrs. Yum. But there's these chains right here on each side, which are great, except that inevitably at some point you're going to lean on this section here so i wanted some kind of support and as you can see i used the black gorilla tape uh, to keep that from rubbing against underneath here so that should slide right in nice and easily let me back up and give you a view of my very messy desk Feel free to like, comment, subscribe, share, and thank you for watching Finding Mark in Maine.